if you remember a while back, I did a uh, video on the ultrasonic cleaner that I had purchased. In those video, I was using um, chemicals that involved vinegar, dishwashing liquid, water, and then uh, there was basically four different phases. First was the vinegar mixture. Second was the baking soda mixture. Third was the hot water bath. And the fourth and vi final rinse was the distilled water. Well, since then, a friend of mine, he had ordered a sample of what's called Micro 90. And uh, we had been talking about it. He had ordered him an ultrasonic cleaner. And it, the free sample, it's a pretty big bottle. And um, the solution that I'm using to concentrate is uh, a 2% solution. Um, I've got 32 ounces of water and um, I'm going to mix this to 32 ounces. It's a 2%. I'll uh, put up on the screen the correct mixture. I can't remember right off the top of my head right now and I do apologize for that. So the brass I'm going to test this on is some, is some pretty gnarly, crappy looking 45 ACP brass. I use these as dummy rounds and things like that. Because they're, they're really crappy looking. I like my brass to look really, really good. I want to have some before and after pictures. But as you can see, it's got some discoloration on it. These are range brass. Primer pockets. Looks pretty cr cruddy. The inside looks pretty cruddy. And I have about 25 pieces of this that I'm going to um, test this out on. And all 25 pieces looks just like that one particular piece. Um, got them all right there in my hand. So I'm going to go ahead and set these in the cleaner. Now, I haven't got in touch with him to see how long he had cleaned his brass for. According to him, he was able to do this in one setting and then rinse. If I get the same results, pretty much this is what I'm going to go after. So I've got warm water in there. I'm going to use a medicine dipper. It goes up to 5 milliliter. I want to put three 5 milliliter doses in there. And the last one's going to be four and a half milliliter. So 5, 10, 15, 19.5 milliliters of this to 32 ounces of water. Now, up to the four and a half mark. Now, I'm not going to sit here for the full eight. I'm going to do this for the 420 seconds, eight minutes. I'm going to do a cycle of that. So...
Now I've got that on and running. Let's go in and look at that sonic. There we go. That's that good sonic action. So I'm gonna let I'm gonna let this work for eight minutes. Then I will turn this back on and check it out. And if it's not clean after eight minutes, we'll try another eight minutes. Now keep in mind, this brass, this particular brass probably isn't a good subject. I don't know what is on the brass. It's not really dirt or anything. So um, these 25 pieces might not be that good of a test medium. However, the inside and the primer pocket and some of the brass will be shiny. I'm just not sure if I can clean the other stuff off. So, you know, hold on tight. We'll be right back and check out the rest. Okay, that eight minute bath is over. I'm looking on them. I still see those places like that. However, look at that primer pocket. inside so you know like I said this might not be the best brass to test this um, but I'm gonna run it another eight minute cycle so I'm gonna see what 16 minutes of this um, let's turn this light off right quick Let's see what um, 16 minutes will do. Be right back. Okay, after 16 minutes, and I'm still getting the brass with that on it. So I'm fairly convinced whatever it is, it's not coming off. So now I'm going to do my final rinse of this batch. I mean, there's the primer pocket. The inside. So, let me grab another batch. It'll probably be a second part video and give it a uh, real honest test and show you what it'll do to regular brass that has not been etched like that. So, for this video, uh, we'll call this finished and I'll catch you on the flip side.